there is this saying that no matter the occasion you are to attend, it's always good to slay. I mean slay. Hello guys, welcome to the episode of the Fashion Gleam Show. Yes, the Fashion Gleam Show versus the Fashion Gleam Shock Show. Taking fashion to another level and bringing to you the art of fashion. Guys, this episode is full of much fun of this reality show that has been making everybody to talk. Yes, but before we get into the show, you all are welcome. Thank you. Welcome back guys. On this episode, we'll be talking about the Biggie 237. Yes, some people call it Big Brother Cameroon. I'll be talking on what the contestant wore in the entry ceremony to get into the house. I didn't want to talk about this, but people have been inboxing me and they have been saying that you need to talk about it. Biggie is all about fashion. You need to talk about it. Let's discuss it. I say, okay, now I'm bringing to you it, guys. Yes, 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 we have had a lot of disgrace, we have had a lot of fun time, we have had a lot of every humor, everything, spicing since the Big Brother Cameroon started. The Big Brother 237 started on the 2nd of August this 2020, and um, it has been moving on well, yes, but here, I'm just here to bring to you what the contestants wore when they were entering into the house. So our first contestant I'm going to bring to you today it's brown popsy. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Celebrity style life. Oh, na be on start. Oh yeah. Look at what somebody wants to become a celebrity is wearing. Actually, entering into a big brother's house. Yeah. I, I actually, <laughs> for me, but yeah, it's just a hunter, hunter man. Seriously, I know like popsy did a hunter man. You stand yesterday hunter man. Seriously, you just day. They say nothing. I want to be celebrity. Just they see. Actually, I love his the Ankara fabric is he used. I love the the conception of the pinafore he had in mind. But I didn't expect him to wear this kind of outfit with like this kind of outfit going in for the Big Brother Two Three Seven Mansion. Serious the entry. The, his cap. My mama is always on chop push and open market. And yeah, guys. I don't know, but for me, if I have to grade him for me, I'll give him a 5 on 10. What do you think? Yeah. Our second contestant we have here is aka Bacha Blanche, small pepper. Yes, Bacha Blanche. Hey, hey. And Tin knocking at his jeans and t shirt going for entry ceremony for Big Brother 237. Fear. 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 They say Biggie 237. These are people who want to become celebrities. They see how you're This is where you start selling yourself as a celebrity. But she just came and said, and yeah, four, four and ten. I'm done. We have our next contestant we have on the list is Akere Nerissa. Woo! Guys, this is this is packaging. Say packaging do her. This is fashion. And this is packaging. I love the way she came out. I love her outfit. Girl, you look splendid. You look, you look like a queen. Look at, it. in fact, see the way she. Came. I love her outfit from that. The designer really came out. The way they had designed the dress is being played down, can flip. In fact, I love. You see all her contours is showing everything. I give ten on ten for this outfit. Not shaking. I love her outfit. The next person we have is TJ. Yes, TJ. I love his outfit. I love that. Pants, the Ankara fabric he used for his pants, the t his shirt, black shirt, his I mean, suit. I love that texture, mixing the Western world and the African together. I love it, man. Your outfit is cool. For this reason, I'm going to give him 8.5 on 10 for his outfit. It's his, he really made it to the point. And next person I have here is MC Claire. Yes, MC Claire. Wow. I love her outfit too. She was dressed by T. Jack Fashion, yeah. I love her outfit. That First of all, that Ankara you used, it portrays African in you, yes. They, then the design, I love the way the yeah, designer played in it, in kind of like bringing it to a twisting. I love I love the outfit, the watch, the, the, the other stuff, the, the play with the material. I love what he did. Actually, I love your outfit. I'm gonna give you Eight for this outfit, eight and ten for this outfit. Yes, eight and ten. And next person I have here, it's photo brand new. Wow, 
men in black. Ooh, this guy Komoto. Say men in black do I, I love his outfit, man. I love everything on him black. Perfect, cool for me. I'll give him a 10 on 10 for his outfit. Yes, 10 on 10 for his outfit. I love it. The next contestant who really ginger that they made me to really feel like, yeah, we are representing Cameroonians on the board. Oh, yeah. Dukong Jure. Yes, I love his Ankara outfit. I love the conception of the Cameroon wear, the Pokoy, the Bermuda, where he came out with it. His short pants together with the up, then the particular in mask that I love everything. Um, Eric Dupes, yeah, Eric Dupes too. Yeah, I love this concept. Yeah, 70 and Karabi culture is leading. Eric Dupes, I love what he's wearing. I love his outfit, man. I love what he's wearing. I love this and this Cameroon wear. Yes, I love it. The next person we I have here it's. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ooh. I love this blue. What I'm saying, I love the from that's the Yadze. I mean, Zena day, it come out the way the designer came out with the outfit, the fur brought into it to play with it. I just I love everything that is in this outfit. Seriously, I love it. It's cool, it's splendid. My next contestant here, I have it's Epier Collins. <laughs> Say fashion, do her. Say Max, do her the Max conception. Yeah. Before, if I can recall, Big Brother said they had to quarantine them for two weeks before they were getting into the house. So I don't know. Anyway, she's playing with the Max conception. Anyway, Bert actually. This Max thing downgraded your outfit, Collins. I'm not gonna lie, you brother. I'm telling you. The team so it's poor all team. See, you for the one, you for the boss now with some eight on ten. I will give now so, but it's too long and so you don't think it will down. I will give six. Seriously, I love your Ankara. The the Aguada, I love it. It's cool, man. But just that thing in front of you spoiled. Everything. The next person I have here is Ranibel Kizzy. Yes, Ranibel Kizzy. I love her outfit. I love that dark green. Dark green. Yeah, the dark green she's using. I love the dark green she's using. She used the, the, the felt that they also played in her outfit. The details on the neck, down on her broken. I love what she is wearing. She's looking cute, splendid. She's looking beautiful i love this outfit girl you look good the, the next contestant who also brought in like who came out with force like <laughs> mc the benja hey this is color rocking fear fear i love this outfit man seriously i love this pink that he brought in with white shirt He's, in fact, I love the way you played with your colors. Yeah, his shoes. In fact, you're looking good, bro. This outfit, eh? Me. This outfit, I'll give you 8 on 10 this outfit. Yes, you're looking good. Yep. Another person who also dead color was Gaga Wayne. Yes, Gaga Wayne. I love this outfit. She was just simple in this her pink dress. She was just cute in it. Nothing much. I just like the spicy. She was just like straight to the point gaga i love your outfit yes the next contestant that we have on this episode is cindy stainless yes cindy stainless i love the black and white she brought in her pants plus the coat jacket in it and um, the sleeveless like the bra that she has inside like she's cool in it the white i love i love she's just simple and straight to the point. Yes, the next contestant I have here is Kitchen Boy. Yes, yes, culture for the culture. Boy, I'm a dance for you for the culture. Oh, yes, music. Yes, this is your Kitchen Boy. Kitchen Boy, yes, this is for him. We are representing our culture is not down. Oh, we are giving. Yes. Hey. 
I love his outfit. I love everything about his outfit. Kitchen boy. I love what this guy. This guy is representing Cameroon. He's representing his coach. I just love everything in him. His outfit, man, is cool, guy. I'll give you a ten on ten for this outfit. You made it. Cool. Hey. Yes, the next contestant will also pop up with another, like, will pop up with the Cameroon wear, with the Bermuda wear, it's Brazil, yes. I love his outfit, I love the Aguada construction of the grass field he brought in, but my problem with him was just the, his pants, because he came in with the Ankara pants to play with it, it was cool, yes, but that did not make it for him, I'm gonna give him 8 on 10 for this outfit. Yes guys, I hope you are enjoying how the contestant dress as we are getting to the Big Brothers Mansion. Yes, the next person I have is King Aloin. I love his conception too of bringing in the coat, the, the, the suit conception. It's like, it's booming. I, most of the guys were like, yeah, party, it's cool, I love it. But it was a lining suit he's wearing together with his black pants and black shirt. Anyway, it made sense for him. For me, I'm going to grade him a 6 on 10 for this outfit. Yes, a 6 on 10 on this outfit. Another person who also made me feel like the girls were not left behind. Yes! Was nobody else than Melinda Swang. I love her combination, the color combination. I love this outfit. It was, she was just simple, straight to the point and cute. Yes, I'm going to give her... For me, 7 on 10 for this outfit. Yes, 7 on 10 for this outfit. Guys, the top winners of the best dress in the Big Brother Mansion are for the female, we have Akere Nerissa. Yes, she won. She is the best dress for me. I don't know what you think, but I think she is the best. Yes, she's the best. For the guys, we have Futsu Brani. Yes, Futsu Brani. He's the best dress for the guys. And for the culture. Yes, for the culture. Because I am Cameroon, I am Africa, I am proud of myself for the culture. I'll give it out for Kitchen Boy. Yes, Kitchen Boy. I love his outfit, man. All of them got 10, 10, 10. Guys, I come to you for the end of this episode of the Fashion Gleam Show versus the Fashion Gleam Show. Please continue to love, subscribe, and like. And see you in our next episode. Thank you. Far away.